Two, one, action. Did you already start it? I already started All it. All right. Hey, guys. So, um, uh, <laughs> go ahead. Um, we're going to put this table away because we finally got a board game table. Now we're going to uh, build. Yep. Yep. This, yeah, because the uh, whole store thing didn't work out. This is going to be our field trip spot Friday. So we'll still show some of those videos, too. I'll probably be a different video, but... So, um, on the Kickstarter, I got this Nilo board gaming table. It looks like a reputable, reputable company. There were some issues. Um, we we're supposed to have this in November. It is now May. It's recording this at the end of May. Um, so, there's five boxes. My stuff's supposed to come in. I got one, which was over there. It's just the felt popper. I can't point because everything is backwards. Put that box there. Anyway, uh, then a couple days later, these two guys came. Um, which I think are the bulk of the table. The accessories that I asked for, um, the cup holders and like the little rail guard and uh, like stuff for cards and stuff like that, those haven't come yet. And we're going on vacation soon, so I'm a little worried that's going to show up then. Um, but yeah, I'm a little concerned because the box is a little torn up and it looks like they had taped. There's like some cut wood here that they taped on the end of it because this box is not reinforced. So I'm a little bit worried. Um... Apparently they like sent a message to FedEx about taking care of the boxes, but as you can clearly see, that was ignored. So I'm a little worried. Um, I'm starting to think I should have just gone with a different company, but we will see. We're gonna put it together and hopefully have a lovely board game table. Okay, we're done. We have our gaming table, our <coughs> Nilo gaming table. Um, what do you think, Dave? I think it went well. Guys. Obviously, you saw I started with uh, Phaedra and Bridget and had them for about five minutes, and then Dave had to take over. Thank you very much, yep. Dave. Sure. I could not have done it without you. Um, there's a lot of prompts to this table. Um, there's one for example that corner is going to haunt me um there's it's like uneven in places it's just poorly designed i mean the instructions were shit capital s and he doesn't like to talk bad about things i'm just being honest i mean if somebody wants to buy a nylo table they probably want this feedback i would not I suppose i will be contacting them um this is not worth what i paid for it all kinds of scratches and it came six months late, too. Yeah, they led us to believe that it was being made in America. That's part of the reason why I purchased it. But it was on a slow boat from China. And then COVID delayed all that. But um, yeah, there's like this little rubber thing around it that we still don't know if it's supposed to be there or not because the instructions don't reference it at all. There's some times where they reference uh, using screws from one bag a couple of times, which depletes them all. So we had to guess as to which one's place you were actually supposed to use it. Um, what else? Some of the holes that didn't line up there on the bottom of this table, there were no holes at all. Um, in the original instructions on the Kickstarter page, they talk about how uh, this page, this board here, you can just flip it over if it ever gets worn down. No, I can't. I just screwed holes into it, like 10, 20 holes into it. Um, I mean, you know, it, it definitely feels sturdy. There's some positive things to it. I like the color, um, where it's not scratched off or rubbed off. Um, I mean, you know, it's a decent size. Um, it's got, let me show you underneath here. It's got these little pins that you can pull out and move it to different depths. Of course, getting it to the first one was a Herculean challenge. If you watch that um, time-lapse thing, you'll see there was a couple of places we spent a lot of time. And some places where, because it wasn't clear, it was very ambiguous, we guessed wrong, so we had to take it apart and do it again. So it took us, my watch is not coming on, what time is it there? I think three or four hours to put this thing together. Six thirty-five. Yeah, four hours to put this thing together. <clears throat> I don't think that. And just today, the tabletop came. It's supposed to go on top of this. I am not up for that challenge. And then sometime, eventually, I'm supposed to get the accessories, like the 
cup holders and things for cards and stuff like that, which will probably come within the next three weeks while we are on vacation, even though I asked them when it would come and they assured me it would be here on time. Of course, they also assured me it'd be here in November, six months ago. So... They also have lots of screws. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we were shorted some screws. And a couple we had extra of. Oddly enough, the ones we had extra of was the exact amount we were missing for other ones. I, I kind of lost track. I should have wrote down all the problems. Um, it is a gaming table. It is upright and it is sturdy. Beyond that, don't think it's worth your money. Anywho, um, still, we are going to play a hell of a lot of games on this thing, as you can see from our collection. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys.